Hey, Mr. Mark, this is Max Kalschmidt from Anchor 23 Marketing Agency. Um, I'm going to give you this attack plan that you could honestly do this yourself if you wanted to. I know that you said you had some bad experiences with other marketers, but I'm just going to show you three main things that you could do right now that will help your web website rank and stay there and continuously give you leads each month. So the first thing is content. And first of all, I'd like to point out that I really like how you have this free quote button right here, as well as the click to call. It just is really easy for people to get in contact with you through your website. I like that a lot. Um, so you're definitely going to want to get ranked so that people will see your website and be able to click on those. So the first thing that we're going to go over is content. And I copied everything on your home page right here. And your home page looks good. However, I'll show you this. I threw it in here and it only has 313 words on it. If you want to be number one on Google, you probably want about 1,500 to 2,000 words. And you want those words to be rich with a specific niche, niche and um, area keywords, such as, and I'll show you here. If we go open up a new tab, painters in Santa Barbara, that specific keyword gets about 250 searches every month. So that's 250 people that are actively searching for the service that you have. Um, and you're going to want to be ranked, especially in this Google Map Pack, because that gets about 65% of the clicks. So the next thing that you could do to your website in order to get it kind of up and going, and I'll show you, let me, let me show you the competitor's website first. So as you can see, they're ranking right here, number one in the Google Map Packs, and they're on this front page right here. Okay, and their content is nearly 1300 nearly 1400 words and they do have some keywords in there but not enough to where it isn't like you could outrank them if you wanted to um, and i'll show you this here see they have a ton of content here however if you get 1500 and you put a few more keywords in there you're going to outrank them and get in that google map pack so the next thing is backlinks so i took your url here put it into this tool that i use and it's showing that you have zero backlinks. There's not even any data there to pull from. So that could be, I mean, it's good that you have a clean slate because that means that you don't have any spammy backlinks as well. But if you, if you really want to get up there and get your website producing business for you, like the person that's ranked number one, they have 169 backlinks. So of course you could obviously crush those guys. You get 200, 250. And I know how to do that. And as you can see here, this is their website um, health, and it's not very good. You want these two numbers to be as close to possible. So if you were to divide 6 by 22, you'd want it to equal 1. And obviously that doesn't. So the next thing that we're going to show you is um, citations, which if we go here and you look in this Google Map Pack, this really helps with the Google Map Pack. It's their name, their address, and their phone number. I'm sorry name, address, phone number. And they put that throughout Google in certain areas like yellow pages, other citation, bbb.org. Um, and your competitor, they have 23 citations, which is easily beatable. I mean, they have theirs on like Facebook and whatnot. You could go in and do that. Um, you, however, only have 14. So if you were to get that, you were to increase your backlinks and you were to put a little bit better, more content on your front page, you could easily outrank the number one competitor and you could be pulling in 75 more customers each month. So I hope that this video helped. If you have any questions, you can always call me and thank you for your time.